Viviana, Jules, and Shan, we shall present to you the do's and don'ts when it comes to technology usage. So our first commandment is those shall not deliver it spreading false information across the media. Spreading false information is never the right thing to do. It obviously affects our morals. The spread of fake news is something that people doesn't deserve. Like, why on earth would people deserve to digest an unimportant information when they're just trying to know the truth? Our second commandment, those shall not cyber bully. When was bullying ever right? The field of online media shouldn't be used for this. Social media occurred to our world to help with communication and bullying is never welcome. So for our third commandment, those shall not use the product of technology for too much self-amusement such as playing too many video games. As technology advanced in our society, some individuals produced video games as forms of entertainment for everyone. Although it can lead to addiction and uncontrolled usage, that's why always remember to manage your time. Hey guys, it's me, Eliana. So thank you so much, Cass, for explaining the first and third commandments. So now I'm going to be explaining the fourth, fifth, and sixth commandment. Okay, so for the fourth commandment, it is, Thou shall not lie or fake your appearance to the media. Because we should always be proud of what each of us has become. Faking your personal life isn't necessary as we should embrace who we are as people. We shouldn't use the advantage that the media and technology has given us into a negative light. For the fifth commandment, we have, Thou shall not hack or go into other people's privacy. Because we shouldn't illegally get information and use it for malicious re reasons like harassing, exposing, or to financially harm someone. We shouldn't use the power of technology as a weapon to hurt the people around us. It is only ethical for a person to respect the privacy of other people regardless if you know them or not and not use it for like what I said, again, malicious reasons. Okay, for the sixth commandment, we have Thou shall protect and back up one's data. Backups are of utmost importance, whether it be for personal or professional use, because data that are becoming ever more frequent and relevant in today's day and age. However, attacks from other people aren't the only thing harming your data because there's this thing called natural disasters, which are like errors that can erase your data. And that's why it is essential to back up important data. Well, it doesn't even have to be important, but all of your data frequently in order to avoid these unforeseen circumstances. That's it for me. Now I'm going to call Jules to discuss the next ones. Well, hi guys, I'm Julian, and as your vlogger for today, I'm going to have the commandments 7 and 8. With commandment 7, those shall not be too reliant on technology. With this, humans have reached a point where they're overly reliant on technology. So, though technology has made life more convenient and accessible, we cannot deny that humans cannot live without it. With commandment number 8, those shall always be cautious when interacting with people online. Contacting someone has become easier than ever thanks to the internet. And people hiding behind the screen and anonymous names are not afraid to interact in order for them to know someone as well. Hey guys, it's Shen. Today, I'll be talking about commandments number 9 and 10. Commandment number 9 says, Thou shalt not click suspicious links, advertisements, and the like. We should always be extra cautious when clicking suspicious and unfamiliar links and attachments for this could easily access our personal information such as passwords and address. Commandment number 10 says, Thou shall be wary of scams. We should always triple check the products we purchase because some people try to put up a fake front to scam people for money. And that concludes all the commandments. Thank you for watching! Thank you.